Thank you. Hi, welcome back to another. Why are you so black? Because I'm black. What do you mean? No, why is it like this? Because I'm darker than you. What are you talking about? Uh, why is it like this? It's fine. Come no, on. No, I can barely see you. You can literally see me. Come on. Okay. Oh, damn. Come in closer. I don't have any closer to oh, me. Oh, okay. So we got red crab. Is this okay? Yes. And uh, uh, uh. Wait, we're trying their crab. Oh shit. We're trying their crab cakes. Don't mind the fan. It's hot as hell in here. Girl, okay, these little, little, these little, 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 little four crab cakes. What the hell? Okay. Girl, that was sixteen dollars. Why is it only one? Oh, it's two oh, and I got one. one. Oh, we're sharing it. Yes, I told you I just put extra of my stuff in there. I didn't get. It. Oh no. Uh, that would have been a hundred dollars. This nope. was eighty altogether. I want to try this crab cake first. I don't know what that tastes like. But I uh, usually. Oh, and here's the sauce for the crab cakes. I'm sorry. I usually wear gloves, but I'm not doing that today. It's all, it's annoying to wear gloves. Wait, hold on. I got a. Ooh, it's juicy everywhere. Ugh. Can you see? Oh, I should have gotten me a napkin. They have little wipes. Oh. Are we trying the crab cakes first since you never tried them? Yeah. Um, the I don't know what kind of sauce this is. Mayonnaise and ketchup. Okay. All These look good. <laughs> Tangy. Yeah, it's made in ketchup with sauce. I mean, with, ooh, shit, that's hot. Mm. The crab cake is good. That sauce is hot as hell. I don't like hot food, so this is a no. This is mushy. He can have the rest. She doesn't. Oh, <laughs> what, what, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. I forgot you like heat. Okay. She doesn't understand foods. I don't even remember the last time I've been on your channel. I don't remember either. Okay, so I wanted to film today's video because uh, I didn't contemplate this week. So I guess we're just going to talk about life. So I'm going to start with... I really hope y'all can hear us. Yeah. I'm going to start with... Um, uh, I used the gloves they used to tie the bag and now my gloves are contaminated. You got something on your nose ring. I like how she never gives me directions. She either just digs in my nose or doesn't say anything. <laughs> but anyways, so I got pulled over the other day. And I was driving the camera. I wasn't even driving my charger. Mind you, this officer... Oh, I'm sorry. We got potatoes, corn, crab, sausage, and eggs. And shrimp, yeah. Okay, so I noticed that the officer was trailing me like on my way to my house i had just picked my look not my little sister <laughs> my older sister up from work and i'm like he about to pull us over because my tag is bad well my mom's tag is bad on the camera so i'm like whatever i'm about to get pulled over for this he literally follows me all the way to my house and then he decides to turn his sirens on and i have um can you move that box so i can move this down please what i need I need you to just move it to the side. Move Turn it hair. sideways. Move. That's fine. Thank you. He um he was following me up when I got over the train tracks to my house. Mind you, my house is like a minute and 30 seconds from the train track. And I have a private driveway. So he lit his siren like in front of my house. And I still turned into my cul-de-sac because I'm not stopping in the road. And then I didn't want to stop in front of anybody's house. So I stopped on the street like that leads to my backyard. They pull me up. Oh, damn, what can I do? Are you gonna keep talking? No. She'll continue her story later. I guess I'll go first. Cause she, I don't know what the fuck's wrong with her. But, um, I don't think there's really anything to update. I hate my job very much, but I also did decide that I'm going to college. She said she's coming with me. <laughs> I don't. I don't know why she's lying about that, but she's coming with me supposedly. We're supposed to be going to UNCG next year. I did tell myself that, oh, I applied to a radiology program this year, but I didn't get it. So I was going to um, try again next year, and if I didn't get it in that time, I, I'd go to actual college. But this time, I was just like, eh, no. 
excuse me, I don't really feel like um, waiting on that. So, I just decided that I'm going to school. I tried to do an early application, but obviously they have application windows, and the only time I could apply was this year in the spring. No, this year in the summertime, and this year in the fall. But, um, yeah, I can't do that. And then we're waiting until August to get certified for CNA. So, um, I don't really know how this is going to go. I guess I'll just not go to school until the fall and just work from January to August. Because I don't feel like going to school all the time. I took a gap year. I mean, it was really a gap year because I did school during. But I guess you could call it a couple of gap years. I'll be 20 when I go to school. So we'll see how that goes. Everybody I know is going to be halfway done already. And I'm just going to be like, oh. Okay. That's not but, the case. Some people fail. But <laughs> but I'll um um I'll double up on classes kind of. Ooh, shit in there. Ah. That is the tail. I didn't know they. St they're still. Why is the shit line so far? It's the tail. What do you mean? This ain't no more tail. This is just shit. <laughs> don't eat it. But um. I don't eat crustaceans for that reason. She doesn't eat crustaceans for her damn daddy. But um, yeah, but everybody. Reason. Ooh, glee. Sorry. But everybody's gonna be done with school by that. Well, not done, but halfway done. But at least I won't have to live on campus because I don't want to be on campus. Campus just seems annoying, and having to share a bathroom with multiple people sounds disgusting. But did you? Is that the one we're going on a trip? Yes. Oh, okay. But we're getting very close to our trip. We have, God, Lee, excuse me. We have, um, we leave on the 29th. Today is the 16th. We have 13 days. We're leaving, uh, first trip. Yes, yes. We're leaving in 13 days at like 3 o'clock in the morning. And then when we get down there, we're going to go visit my grandmother. And then I'm going to take her to try this place called Nick's. And then we're going to go. Oh. Damn. I'm sorry, y'all. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. Oh. you talk for something it's good right here no it's not but um yeah we're gonna try dicks and then we're gonna go back to B&B and sleep we're gonna sleep 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 all day oh we'd be so sleep. tired sleep. I, we'd be so tired she'd be more tired than me but I'm I'm always tired but I can never sleep so well, I'll be ready to go sleep I need to probably text some melatonin or something I literally have the pills for it I just never take them I'm gonna take some tonight though and go to bed because when I go to work on Thursdays, I'd be so tired. So I'll come over here and just rest for a little bit. Also, because I like seeing her. But, um, yeah, I'll come rest for a little bit. And then I'll go home. And I'll be up till like 2 o'clock in the morning. Because I don't have to get up till 10 on Friday. Because I don't go to work till 12. Well, I need to take but a then, water break. You gotta take a body break. I'm sorry, a water break. Sorry. Oh. The blood's making noise. But then on Saturday and Sunday, I have to work 8 to 8.30. So, yeah. And then I can't really do anything on Saturday or Sunday because everything's closed and she's at work too. But hopefully that gets that's over when we get back from our trip. They're supposed to be getting stop kicking my stand. And my legs need to stretch. They're supposed to be getting a new person to help. So my shift to be shortened. Because what I do, I do the most out of everybody. And I'd be tired. Excuse and they gonna be tired. But I never go to sleep on Sundays, which is really weird. You're just nine minutes of me yapping about nothing. <laughs> But um, naked. But I never go to sleep on Sundays because she's at work, and sometimes she'll be dead. Not dead. Sometimes the <laughs> store will be dead, so I can talk to her. Sometimes that's rare though. I also be playing my game. I don't know why I never go to sleep. I guess I don't be tired. Like I said, I be tired. But are you ready to talk now? Yes. Now that I got some food, I was. I guess I was hangry because I didn't eat. I didn't really eat all day. I didn't eat at Pizza Hut, and then you told me to wait to get the seafood boy with you. And I didn't want to like lose my appetite for this because I, when I came home from work, I went to sleep. But anyways, so he pulled me over in my cul-de-sac. Well, I stopped in my cul-de-sac, but I passed two houses coming down because I didn't want to stop in front of nobody's house. So he comes to the car and he's like, 
You know, um, when somebody, when uh, a police is pulling over, you stop immediately. I was like, I put my hats on to notify you. I was like, I didn't feel safe, safe stopping in the road. He was like, it doesn't matter. I understand, but it doesn't matter. I'm like, okay. Okay, because clearly, sir, you don't understand. I'm a black female. What the fuck? Anyways, he pulled me over because he said it was a, a Camry that just got stolen that fit the description of my car and the window was busted on the left side. One, all four of the windows rolled down. Two, you ran a tag. You know I live in this neighborhood. You know it's not the person you're looking for whose car is stolen. So why are you still going after me? Three, I honestly think they made that shit up to reach your quota. And then he gonna talk about I was following you four blocks down and you didn't stop. He didn't have a siren on. He he had his lights flashing when we passed my house in the front. Even though he was following me like a minute and some change before that. I guess he didn't know he didn't have his stuff together. I think he was a rookie. I don't know. But I assume they just pulled me over since they was trailing me and they needed me to a certain, certain quota they came like three deep pulling up behind me talking about that was suspicious of me how's that suspicious if i literally put on my hazards you know this is where i live you know this is a register under a woman what the fuck is suspicious about me and then he um and then there was two cop cars that passed by this way so i guess i do believe his story that um they were looking for a missing camera but i was very stupid and my dad came out hostile my dad used to be a sheriff so he knows all the laws and stuff and he's like, well, it says on the news. <laughs> he just came being so hostile. And I don't like that for my dad because he don't know how to. But he was like, it says on the news that if you don't feel comfortable, you, you stop until you're ready. And you alert them with your hazards. And he was like, how can you tell her one thing and they're showing us another? And he's basically like, sir, can I finish a conversation with your daughter? And another officer had to pull my dad to the side because he was just hype and turn already. He had his arms crossed and everything. He came outside with the slides, the feet out, and the ripped up tank top. He was, I he was, imagine that. yes, so he funny. was oh, so bro. over it. He was so over it. And honestly, like, uh, that situation was so dumb. And then, but that was really it. Like, I was very confused that nothing about that made sense. But I was like, it's whatever. Then, Tell me why the reason why I took the camera to get my sister because it was raining the, the the day of. I backed my charger up to like do a three point turn in my driveway. My whole driveway is on concrete, like it's grass on both sides and a strip of concrete, and there's dips on the grass. So guess who gets stuck in two dips? Both of the front wheels stuck in two dips. The back wheels hydroplane. The mud is splattering everywhere. The water is just too high. Excuse me, my car couldn't move, so I had to take the camera. Then the second day, me and Patrick, we tried to, like, uh, not help the flood. Help Drain the, the flood, but, like, getting buckets of water, dumping it out. We tried to put towels on the wheel. What if we put a board under the towel, uh, under the tire. It didn't work. So today, I was trying to call, oh, and we tried calling the towing company. One was, like, I'm going to give you somebody else. The person he gave us to was, like, send me a picture and hung up on us. Nigga, no. And then the third person didn't even answer. So I asked my dad for his person. I asked him if he's 24 hours. He's like, yeah. Girl, I go on the website, they closed. So I had to wait today. And then I called them this morning. And then they're like, um, they're like, they don't have any drivers, even though they just opened. So what do you mean you don't have a driver? And it'd be a couple of hours. And I had to go to work. So I was like, whatever. I just Uber to work. Then my dad came home. And then he, he coincidentally was like driving through our neighborhood, saw somebody with a, a tow truck in the yard. I was like, hey, can you tow this truck? I told this car um, at my yard, they charged him $80, and the other man was trying to charge him $125. So we got a steal, but I had to pay for it, and I'm very sad about that, because it's my daddy's fault. He should have been to his yard working his duties. But my car is is okay now. I just know not to do three-point turn in my driveway. I got to just... Um, That's a little update about me and why I've been upset. I mean, um, I passed my first... It's more? You got weed stuck to your hair. Who the fuck did you. your hair? Oh. But what's more? What's more? Oh, my school still hasn't sent me my money. My career coach, I guess she don't know what she's doing. Taco Bell is draining me. I'm tired of working first. I'm so ready to be done. This trip is much needed because I've only been to the beach like two times. I don't really care about it because I've been. I live near the beach, so. Actually, I live, no. I was about to say I lived on the beach, but like I live like five minutes away from the beach. I got goddamn sauce on the goddamn table. Goddamn. It didn't take that long for me to get to the beach, but I'm just glad she gets to go and see the things that I grew up with. Yes, and eat the food. And I'm mostly excited because 
his party, well, not his party, his little gathering with me, China, and in his room is Spider Man theme. And I have so much stuff that I got for him. And I'm just trying to decorate his room. And I got China a spider costume. So she's going to be a little spider. And you weren't supposed to remind me because I definitely forgot about that. He'll forget again. He got bad memory. I won't. It took me like two weeks to forget because I just forgot. <laughs> But I didn't pass it by his mama if I could bring that dog in her house. But China really be straight. She's so quiet. You just gotta make sure she use the bathroom and get a good, a good rest. Uh, she sleep anyways. I'm gonna just bring her bed and some pee pee pads. Hopefully she doesn't get some. She won't. I'm gonna take her out before we go in. Carpet. That's why I'm bringing the pee pee pads. She knows the pee on that. But I don't think oh, my school doesn't send my money either. They usually do send. Them things. Oh. But they usually send me my money through cash out because that's the card I use at my school. I also use my regular card at school. So I don't know why they didn't just send me my money this time. But they were like. Oh, damn, ain't cracked no crab yet. I can't, but. You didn't want any? Oh, I'll get, get the fat for you. I'm about to fat thing you But um, the only ones I can crack are the claws because you can rip them apart at the bottom. That just busted all over my mouth. <laughs> But they usually send me money on my card. I don't know why they didn't do it this time. But they were like, call this company called Bank Mobile. <laughs> I called them. It's this Indian lady on the phone. Oh, my God. And I can't really understand her. So I'm just like, uh-huh, uh-huh. She was speaking at rapid speed. And she was talking, and like, if she was speaking slower, maybe I'd be able to understand. But no, she was talking so fast. I couldn't understand her. <laughs> the accident make it no damn better. And I'm just like, uh-huh, okay. And then she's like... Can you tell me? She was like, "Can you tell me?" Um, sorry. She was like, "Can you tell me your address and stuff?" I was like, "Okay." And then she was like, "I hear people in the background. Are you are you comfortable? <laughs> are you comfortable giving your information out loud? Like, I have you on speaker for a reason. I'm fine. I don't care." She was like, "Okay." <laughs> you gotta get counsel. She was like, "Okay, give me your social security number." And I was like, okay. And I gave her my social. She was like, give me your um, address and stuff like that. I really don't be feeling comfortable giving all of, my st all, all of them that stuff over the phone because that's really suspicious. Only because where are you? <laughs> where are you answering this call from? What's going on? And why do people on? think people feel so comfortable to just release that information over the phone? I don't know. But um, then she was like, uh, <sighs> then she was like, okay, I'm looking at it now. So it says... No, actually, I hung up on her. Ah. She was taking forever <laughs> to talk about nothing. And she was like, uh, just try again. No, she made me change my email. <laughs> I don't know why she did that. Because that's not the email that I have to use to sign in. So, like, a day or two later, I called them again. It's another Indian lady. And she's asking the same stuff. And I hung up on her, too. Uh -huh. And then, like, a week later, I realized that I tried to, like click forgot password because I fig I finally figured out my email that's associated with the account that I have not used ever, only for Twitter. But, um, yeah. <laughs> only for Twitter. I don't know, I just had a brain fart. But, um, dang, I did it again. But, yeah, that email that I use is not associated with me or my school for real, for real because I don't use my name on, on Twitter emails because why would I? Or Instagram emails because why would I? But, um, yeah. That makes it more fun. <laughs> she tried. So she was like, um, yeah, we're having problems with our system right now. Um, hopefully it's up and running. I hope I didn't drip that on you. I, oh, I should I did. She was like, hopefully it's up and running within the next week. I was like, okay. I called them on the 30th, mind you. Today's the 16th. I tried it again today. The system still don't work. But then they were like, if it's uh, if you haven't made a decision within 20 days, they'll just send it to you. But the thing was, someone made a decision for me. It just was not me. And they said it would mail it by a check. I should have been got my money if it was sitting there for 20 days. Because the refunds were supposed to go out on the 17th of April. It's been a month. I want my money right now. But I ordered, um, I think we got most of our clothes for this trip. I'm tired of thinking about school, so I'm just shifting to another thing. But I think we got everything for our trip. We just have to get down there and get groceries and stuff like that and all that extra stuff. And cleaning supplies to clean the stuff. 
to clean the bathroom and things like that. Um, Speaking of the bathroom, the Airbnb lady they have no picture of the shower. I don't know why she's so fixated on the shower. I don't know. I mean, I have shower shoes. I just hope I have good water pressure. And it has a washer and dryer. In the bathroom. Nice, nice. Mmm. Damn, it's almost gone. I have no corn yet. God, you, damn. you can't eat corn. What? You fuck around crab. Ooh, it's dripping. Smell it with me. Oh, yeah. For me to have gotten extra shrimp, it doesn't seem like there's extra shrimp. Oh, it's all the way over there. It's all the way everywhere. But we didn't get any spice because we didn't have no spice. Whatsoever. Mm. Most spice I can handle, like, Takis or Hot Cheetos. But I have to be in the mood for that. What time is it? Alexa! What time is it? The dining is spent ready to be in. I changed my luck by doing Indian for it. <laughs> it makes it more funny. She thought it would annoy me, but I don't be here. <laughs> so, I don't know why she thought that would do anything to me. I tricked my face. <laughs> Just. No. That's sloppy and greedy. No. Ooh, girl. My God. Oh, shit. I need to get me a shirt. Like, the pieces of corn. Awesome. Uh, where's the black shirt? Smell like what is it? Right. We're using a shirt because I'm not using my towels and I'm not wasting napkins. You need this or you eat better. She definitely got towels to begin with. Not anymore since we used them for the tires. I don't know why her eating is so much more sloppy than mine. I don't know. Maybe because I'm not used to it. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not used to it. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not used to it. I don't know. And plus, you wasn't putting your whole mouth on this cob. Even then, it still wouldn't be that messy. And not my fault is dripping on my face. It still wouldn't be that messy. Let me show you how to eat the corn on the cob, nigga. Excuse me. Wait, hold on. Oh, oh, oh. What do you got going on? Oh, oh. I'm really dainty with my food because my hands are bigger. I can afford to be dainty. My mouth is also bigger, too. Is it dripping down your chin? Well, not a, and he got fatter lips. He got. You don't to eat. Yes, I do. You like a three year old. I don't. We're literally eating it the same. I can really eat this to begin with. How you going to rest of me? Why is my face messy? You like a three year old. I'm doing what you're doing. Actually, I'm eating with like three teeth. So, no, you're not doing what I do. I have bigger teeth, bigger lips, bigger hands, bigger mouth. My mouth is wider, too. Maybe that's why toddlers are messy. That and they're special. But, um. Ooh. Speaking of special, I think my nephew is autistic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. No, no, no. <laughs> Autism is not funny. <laughs> no, only because. His parents are unaware, but he, but he be noticing. He be doing his little, uh, what do you call those? Not tremors. He has stems. Stem. Yeah, those. He has a random stem. Like he'll rock back and forth and swing his arms. <laughs> and he doesn't like loud noises. He runs and you away. Can't run up, you can't walk up on him too fast because he'll run away. And he'll I don't, scream. I don't know if that's autism or what, but it's not for me to find out either. I'm not no doctor. I'm sorry. I just keep flicking you. I'm so sorry. I got him an eyebrow. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Y'all can't cancel me. I have a cousin who's autistic. Autistic. I was saying I have a friend who's black. Oh. <laughs> I said, you know, my friends are black. I didn't say nothing was bad about autism, though. We be laughed about it. Ooh. <laughs> um. You gonna stop it at 30 minutes? Okay. So I have nothing else to talk about. Me either. But it's been very nice talking to y'all. Yeah, I hope y'all can hear us over the crunching, the bags moving, the cracking. She's so dramatic. 
That's how you got corn stuck in your braces. That's how you got stuff on your chin. I do? No. Oh, why my wax, my wax lady don't, she doesn't work at that um, place anymore. I should have asked, do they know where she went? Because girl, I'm trying to follow you. Wasn't she bringing you? She been dropped that baby. That oh, was last what? year. I forgot. But anyway, um, they literally let allowed me to schedule my appointment on Memorial Day. And then she called me and was like, oh, we're closed that day. And then I'm like, okay, well, I'll do the next day. Mind you, she called me off guard because I'm at work, which I don't know. I don't know days of the week. I barely know what today is. And I was like, I asked her latest time because that day I needed to get my nails done. We we're getting a rental that day. And she was like, who do you want to be with? And I confirmed if my lady left because I didn't see her on the website anymore. She's like, yeah, she left. And I thought, like, okay, well, I'll just take the lady that I booked with. For that Monday, and she's like, "Oh, she doesn't come in Tuesday." I was like, okay. Well, just give me whoever is black and can wax coochie at that point. I just don't want nobody who's not my skin color to wax me. I don't know. Something about that just awkward. I feel like they secretly judging me, even though they probably don't give a fuck. Well, speaking of that, my OBGYN is gone. <sighs> so happy. She always treating me like a child, and she was Caucasian, so I felt like I couldn't relate to her for real. I got a black lady now. I don't meet her until we come back from my trip, though. There's Whoa. so much stuff in my teeth. Oh, my God. Ooh, it's just starting to taste like salt now. I don't know what you Um, Taylor's doing better um, in some ways. But I'm still waiting for Taylor to come back strong. And when she does, I can't wait for y'all to see her. Because she used to be in all of our videos. Well, most of them. She's still being. <laughs> yeah, that trait didn't go away. I don't think it ever will. <laughs> I can't really get anything to action. I have to grab it. Uh, I'm so full. I'm sorry, I didn't eat. I mean, I didn't eat. Ooh, but I... there's potatoes. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, it's hot. Did you, not, did you not see me eat one? It's another one right here. It's multiple. Actually. I thought they were gone, though. I need to scrape the sides. Ooh, yes. No, it's a pretty bring up the middle. I can't dig in that bag. Alright, there, there you go, Pimp. There you you go. didn't bring all that to me. Yeah. Oh, so you were the middle. The middle? Yeah, it's in the middle. Eh. All that sausage. I don't know why I got extra sausage. No one didn't put a whole link in here. I couldn't finish mine. We had individual boils. I gave the rest of my sausage to Mr. Buddy. I rinsed off the seasoning and he tore that shit up. Maybe you can do it this time. Yeah, because Poopy's not here. She's not going to eat table scraps anyways. It's potatoes. I mean, it's sausage. Dogs eat meat. No. <laughs> no. She already obese. She's like 14, 15 pounds. And she's a turkey. She's supposed to be a good five pounds. Yeah, and she has hip dysplasia. She can't lay down or sit down the right way. Her legs sit to the side. <laughs> That's not funny. But it ain't my, funny. It's really sad. It's not my dog to take to the vet. I mean, she's still eating and breathing and sleeping. I guess that's what matters. Barely. <laughs> yeah, but nobody got no vet money. That's on their. That's on her own owners. They should have did a better job taking care of her. Cause now they blaming me for her being fat. <laughs> it is true. Every time China. Don't see you be giving her scraps. China's be been fat since 2020. Yeah. She got fat with everybody else. <laughs> like Tamaya and Ken was feeding her stuff like that. Every time they went to like a drive thru China will always get fries or some nuggets. Like, what are you talking about? They're giving her whole orders. I give her a piece of bread. <laughs> you be sharing the fries with her, though. <laughs> no, no. Oh, that'd be me sharing no, fries. When was the last time I gave China fries? Fries? My fries be gone. Ooh, I'm full. God That's damn. the first thing I eat. I'm a fry person, then a burger person. Or oh, nuggets. Either one. Ooh, it's so salty now. I, I can't believe I kept eating for like 30 minutes. Normally I tap out. But I guess since we were taking tour, turn, tour, 
taking turns eating. It wasn't that bad. This is popping all over. I feel like I gotta wash my face. But I hope y'all enjoyed this little talk. Hopefully this video makes it to YouTube and hopefully I don't have to edit that much because I was tweaking at the beginning. Why don't you say it again? I gotta cut that part out too. Oh. Yeah. Damn. Um, yeah, okay. Well, thank y'all for watching. Y'all have a blessed one. Bye. Don't forget to brush your teeth, wash your ass, and floss. I need to floss. Yeah, floss. Oh, I'm sick. Y'all be having gingivitis and don't even know it. Oh. Gum health is very important. I love y'all. Bye. <laughs>